All right, and then we will enter into the hotel room to the bathroom. All right, and then if we just turn to the right and look underneath the sink, plenty enough room for a wheelchair to roll right underneath there. Then a nice little bench for people to set their toiletries down. And then there's also these, the handrails in the bathtub. Uh, they're pretty sturdy, so if somebody needs to lift themselves up, they can do that. And then if you notice the peephole, they have the top one. And then also lower, they have a lower one for people in wheelchairs to look out. And the door handles are pretty nice and easy to grab, so it won't be a problem with that. Alright, we'll go into the main area. A desk right there. Um, couch and a chair. And a little uh, desk. Uh, microwave is down low. Uh, so is also the fridge and the cupboards. A uh, chair. And the bed seems pretty high to get in and out of a wheelchair onto. And something that I found interesting is, um, if you look, you, you'll see the uh, iron and the ironing board hanging on the wall. And if there was a person in a wheelchair, it'd be kind of hard for them to grab that iron all the way up on the top of that wall. And then well, there's plenty of room to wheel around in a wheelchair. You can see in between the bed and the fridge over by the air conditioning unit. Now, when you choose a law career, the moment you embark, there is that joke you're bound to hear. A lawyer is a shock. And then also, uh, there's a laundry room. Um, there's enough room in there for people in a wheelchair to do their laundry, but if you had a couple people in there doing laundry, it'd be a tight squeeze. Kids, it's time you faced. Then we have the front lobby area. Um, there's enough room to go around in there. And then also straight down the hallway, where there's rooms on the left and the right. Chairs right in the middle. And it looks like there's enough room for a wheelchair to roll down right next to the right next to the rooms. <laughs> 